praise the Lord. We glorify you. We honor you, Lord Jesus, in this place. You are the Son of God who is in the midst of us. When we go through the fire, when we go through the waters, you will be with us. And we thank you that you always make a way of escape, Lord. In every trial, in every tribulation, you make a way of escape for us. You are the greater one living in us than he that is in the world. Hallelujah. Praise God. Let's go to the word of God and sing his word. We're going to sing many songs from the scriptures today. The greater one is in us as 1 John 4, 4 tells us that you are of God, little children, and you have overcome them because greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. And as you meditate on this scripture, you see that how there's nothing greater than our God. In that verse in 1 John 4, 4, he doesn't say that there's, there are other things that are greater than me. He says, greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. So when we face a mountain, when we face a problem in our lives, the first thing the devil wants to do is he wants you to magnify the problem that it is greater than your God. But you got to answer it and say that greater is Jesus who is in me than he that's in the world. And you're not a defeat when you know who lives in you. As 1 John 5, 4 also says, whatever is born of God, whosoever is born of God, that means Whoever is born into his family, when you're in the kingdom of God, he tells you that you overcome the world. And this is the victory that overcomes the world, even our faith. Aren't you thankful that God has given you his own kind of faith through which you overcome? And so that means you open your mouth in the face of that trial and you talk to it. You talk to that you know, situation and you say, greater is Jesus who is in me than he that's in the world. And whatever storm, whatever problem you are facing today, that's what you got to do. The devil will always bring thoughts for you to magnify what you're going through. But you decided you're going to say as a believer, I am born of God and I have overcome the world. Greater is Jesus in me. And you're going to see that mountain, it has to be removed. It's going to be removed out of your life. Because the word says when you have faith in God, you can speak to that mountain and it shall be removed. But the key is that we got to not doubt in our hearts because doubt will stop us from receiving what the Lord has for us. But we're not doubters, are we? We are victorious people and we're going to come out victorious through our faith. And that's what we're going to sing about this morning. Every one of you joining us online, be encouraged today that the greater one lives in you than he that's in the world and you are a believer and you have come out victorious. We've got to see the victory that God has already given us. Nothing is greater than Him. And we pray today that you'll be blessed and encouraged as we sing the Word of God and strengthen our faith. Thank you, Lord. We come before your throne of grace, Father, and we, we come and we say that you are the greater one in us. And so, Lord, we will not be afraid of the enemy's threats that he brings against us. For you have given us power and authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy. And nothing shall by any means hurt us. Thank you, Father. We have got the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. And we magnify you and we sing your word over our lives. In Jesus' name, amen. Greater is Jesus. Let's rejoice in him.
strong and of good courage. God has commanded us to be strong. Let's continue to encourage ourselves. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord.
the Lord. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, that you keep us in perfect peace. Oh, thank you, Lord, for your peace that passes all understanding, guards our heart and mind through Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you.